The city had a way of breathing, and its exhales whispered tales of treachery and deceit. It was a dark, unforgiving place, and I was just another soul navigating its twisted streets. I'm Will Crosby, a detective in a world where shadows held more secrets than the daylight ever could. My partner, Ian Gibson, was the yin to my yang. A man of few words, he had a way of seeing through the smoke and mirrors that filled our world. We'd been through hell together, and neither of us was eager to return. But that's the thing about this line of work. It always comes knocking. Ian and I might not be heroes, but in a place like this, we were the closest thing to salvation. Hello! You know why I forgot? You know why I forgot, Ian? Uh, audio? Cigarette. <laughs> Fuck yeah. God, we're so cool! God, I love smoking! It's the best, folks! It tastes it's like the best. diamonds. Oh! Um, ah, God, folks, case, case crackers Stoking. are here. Um, we're here to play Frog Detective. I'm gonna cut over to that so you, you can see it. I have never played this game. This was on a short list, I think just to play? I can't remember why it was on a list um, for Subpixel. And then, uh, was it? And now we're, uh, now we're just doing this. Yeah, I, like yeah. I was, it was on my short list to oh. stream at some point. I think because oh. it was on Game Pass briefly. Oh, it's on uh, Game Pass again soon oh yeah they announced that i bought this and then like 15 minutes later that came out and i was like but it, it comes out like next week or whatever you, so. you cuck i know i always have <laughs> anyways can I say i'm gonna that hit word? play can you there, say i think cuck? there's like yeah i think there's two reasons i can't number one i feel like it may be played out and number two i think it may be too like politically ins uh, insensitive in a way so i don't know what are your thoughts Cuck or not to I, cuck. Just, I feel like the insult cuck uh, went from being actually calling someone a cuckold to just being like what you call someone like a hey, cuck and like stuff like that. And I remember <laughs> hey, when cuck. that when that started, I called someone a cuck who was married and they were like, what? <laughs> like clearly hurt for How a second. I was know? like, oh, no, it's like a it's like an endearment thing. now. Who like, is she cheating like, on me with? <laughs> yeah. Who is it? I knew it. Uh, so uh. that's my thoughts on cuck. I'm gonna hit play. Ah, great. Anyways. Oh, what a beautiful, beautiful jaunt. Beautiful jaunt. Fuck, Let's this see. is first Here. person. Oh, look at that. I hear the phone. 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 Hello, who is it? It's your supervisor. <clears throat> Hi, supervisor. Hey, how's life? Yeah, pretty good, I reckon. How are things with you? Uh, me and the wife just got back from uh, Indonesia. You cuck. Ah, uh, well, sal Salamat Detang Kembali. That means welcome back, I think. Oh, thanks. Anyway, uh, what are you calling about? Oh, right. I have a case for you. Oh, cool. It's a pretty spooky one, so hold on tight. I'm holding on. Ah, well, there's a little slot. It wounds an island just off the bay. Martin's his name. San Martin. He says he's been here on a ghost for about two weeks now. So, get this. He hires a team of ghost scientists. What's a ghost scientist? Uh, I don't know. Beats me. Anyway, he hires some of them, right? And they can't find nothing. They've been on the island for two whole weeks. Longer than I was in uh, Singapore. Wow. Yeah, the ghost is still at large. So, the head scientist there, he's a monkey calls me up they need help and they want the greatest investigator i have unfortunately i'm a desk jockey now so i said to them 
I'll send my second best investigator. But Lobster Cop wasn't available. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm asking you. <laughs> the third best investigator. <laughs> fully understand lobster cops and your abilities are far far outweigh my own yeah but yeah you're pretty good so are you up for it i don't know it sounds very scary i'll have to be very brave oh i believe in you detective that's just what i needed to hear thank you supervisor i'll do it wahoo that's what they say in singapore can you give me a summary of the case before I go? Absolutely not. The basics are... There's a slot who's hearing a lot of spooky ghost noises around the island. I already fucking told you this. this I'm is sorry, like a what is best. hearing it? A what is There's a sloth it? who's hearing uh -huh. a lot of spooky ghost noises around this island. I, this is the third time I'm telling you. He calls a bunch of ghost scientists, but they're stumped. Again, you gotta work on your memory problems. It's up to you to solve the mystery of, I'm calling it, the haunted island. I, really I picked that up case. in China. Why did you yell the haunted island like that? Because that's the title of this case. I just said it. Fair enough. It's time for you to grab your magnifying glass and get the going. See you later, Supervisor. Good luck. Thanks. Goodbye. Now, the magnifying glass should be right next to the toilet. Oh, no. It's right here. Oh, I have that <laughs> problem, too. <laughs> <laughs> Same with the measuring tape. Ah, yes, my trusty magnifying glass. Can't God, solve mysteries. <laughs> It. That frog just looks so fucking good. Like, the visuals, the stance, the animation. I love it. I'm honestly, my number one problem with this game right now is why are you making it first person when all I want to do is look at this frog? You know what I'm saying? This looks like it was made in a 90s demo program for 3D graphics. Oh, yeah, for sure. Wow, a telephono. Let's get out of here. Time to solve a mystery. I changed my voice again. Look at that gate. Fuck God, I love him. Grace. Roxner. Or oh, frog. Fuck yeah. Hey, uh, while this is playing... Uh, the gate's killing me. Can you turn off the gate or whatever? Or give me more game volume? Oh, yeah, yeah. Just need, like, a couple more dB. Or turn off the gate. Better? Yeah. Oh. Martin. Oh. Ho, 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 ho. A daddy? Wait. Is that the lobster? He's not supposed to be here. Lobster cop's not I supposed to be here. I can't believe they called your bit. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, great minds. Joke alike. This is cute. This is like this a is really, really good, good, really good game jam game where if I, you know what I mean? Like, no, no offense or anything, but it's just like, it feels like they were like, we have an idea. It's bonkers. We're going for it. and We're going to throw it together. And I love yeah. it. Hi. Okay. What? Hmm. Maybe a man in a in a suit. Hmm. Are you get oh, to do you this? finally made it. Thanks for coming on such short notice. I've heard so much about your adventures. I'm a huge fan. Wow, that's uh, very kind of you. When you figure out who was behind the forest theft in which town, I couldn't believe it. I thought nobody would ever solve that mystery. I mean, who steals an entire forest? Oh, uh, you've been following my blog posts? Yes, I'm Mystery Monkey 49 I comment all the time. I even made a funny joke once, and you responded. 
Of course, I remember. Hi, Mystery Monkey 49. Please, Mystery Monkey 49 is my online name. My offline name is Mystery Monkey 69. Of course. Can I ask you some questions about this case? Questions, yes. What would you like to know? The resident. Oh, yeah, this is terrible. May I oh, ask who the resident of the island is? I'm giving up on the voice already. Oh, Sorry. you little baby! It's too much. It's I just I can't do voice acting. I throw I throw I throw it too much immediately. <laughs> uh, Martin, find him hiding in the forest. Hiding the forest. Very interesting. I'll investigate. What would you like to? What should I to Let's just start. Who should I talk to first? You're talking to me already. Okay, who should I talk to second? That's a good bit. Okay, that's a good bit. That's Literally. a good bit. Although, I think mostly he wants me, new people to meet him. Huh? Would you like to know? He likes to other people to meet him, not him meeting other people. Like, he doesn't care to form a relationship with you. He just wants you to be dependent on him. Oh, okay. That I literally was like, I don't follow that, but thank you for the... You should be a detective. You figured that out very quickly. <laughs> I can read people like a book, Ian. Oh, there's... Oh, there's... What is that on the ground? Succulent succotash. It's a smiling, legally distinct starfish. Oh, hello. Hey, you, Larry. Hey, nice me, Larry. Huh? Then the noises are not coming from me. Okay. Did not it's Larry. Make this food it's Larry. It's That's 100%. Like more suspicious somehow. What? Are you listening? I said it didn't make the noise. No, I heard. It's just... It's cutting uh. like that. It's not... It's cutting me off. I'm not clicking that fast. Mm. You know what? That's a good bit. It is a good bit. Yeah, like that wasn't me. Do you think he's on like ketamine? Probably. Well, ketamine is a tranquilizer, right? So he's probably on coke. Yeah. He just took what a What is ketamine? Best friends. Give me a second. I'm going to look up what is ketamine. Why haven't you told anyone? It's Nobody a, listens to it. They say stuff like, well, Larry, if you won't listen to us, we won't listen to you, which is so weird, because I do listen. I'm a really great listener, so how do you get into the cave? Well, I need a few things. To go through there, you'll need some sort of explosive device. Is that safe? We're dealing with ghosts here, Detective. None of this is safe. Anyway, I'll need a few things. I'll look at an explosive recipe on one of the old chemistry books. I need toothpaste, some wool, and a chunk of pure gold, and some pasta. Oh, so normal explosive ingredients then. Just a standard explosive recipe. Yes, if you want to get into that cave, bring me those ingredients. I'll do my best. Ask me, ask me the questions. Uh, what's the explosion? What are you going to use that for? Let's make some dynamite. Not yet, detective. Oh, we still need it. I'm sorry for choosing that option. Was it toothpaste, right wool, now. and... Uh... Pasta and something else. Uh, you ever heard of ketamine therapy? No. Anyways, I looked up ketamine. It's 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 a slightly hallucinogenic anesthetic. Um, but ketamine therapy, it's weird because I feel like ketamine is kind of like a drug of choice in the UK. But over here, it's not that illegal from what I can tell. So people are starting to like microdose it as like... As, as like a mental health drug. It's oh. weird. That is weird. Yeah. This, uh, I'm talking to this guy uh, now. Uh, who's the guy in the water? What guy in the water? <gasps> that guy in the water. <laughs> I don't know. That's the terrifying. What the fuck you doing over there, koala? Is this... Do you... Can I ask you a genuine question? And I want a genuine answer here. Yeah. Do you think this game has or will eventually have or could potentially have racial undertones? I don't think so. 
you know, like in Zootopia, where they're like, your kind would never mix with ours. He's a frog. Of course, he's jumpy. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because <laughs> if I was a game developer, like there's two options, right? There's like I can pretend that racism doesn't exist in this world and yeah. be like a child and be like, it's a utopia. The animals don't get along. Or I can be like, no, man, we're going fucking hardcore. We're talking about the racism of frog detective. You know? Yeah, I just thought you were going to say, <laughs> or is it like Zootopia where they don't let any of the Asians in the city? <laughs> like, <laughs> not even a cover up. <laughs> what is it with what kids find? movies? What is it with kids movies and racism recently? Like there was Zootopia, there was Elemental. There were some other movies that are all about. They're being oh, brave. I, there's, um, I feel like there was racist undertones in. Um, was it called Red? Red Red Panta? Oh yeah. Turning oh, red. Yeah. Turning red. That was a good movie. I like that one. That was good. I liked um, it too. I was gonna say, if you ever want a good time, watch Zootopia <laughs> with the Netflix description on, the audio description. It turns it into like a documentary. It's very, very funny. Oh my god. It's really good. <laughs> you know, if a certain substance was legal in Florida, that sounds like it would be yeah. a good time. Um, I remember years ago someone mentioned they did it uh, uh, by accident and they thought Pixar just made a hilarious like documentary oh, ripoff. Yeah. yeah. And uh, so we watched maybe like an hour of it one time and it was genuinely very funny. Magnifying glass is the coolest secret agent item. This guy thought Ghost Scientist was a cover up job, so he came here because he wanted to be a secret agent. Oh, he thought it was like a CIA recruitment ad. Yeah. Do you think, okay, do you think this game, Frog Detective, could potentially, as we play game it, of the year. no, do you think it could potentially take a stance in the Israeli-Palestinian conflict? <laughs> potentially. I'm gonna going to say there's probably, a, a there's probably a 25% odds that at some point it does reference it, because this seems like a pretty hip hip edgy game <laughs> the fuck are you uh yep great is that how you i don't i'm trying to think is that how i would sit i think i would sit like that yeah if i had to be sideways in a chair D -Tech. like that fresh x flesh x fresh x that's a pretty good name for an alligator crocodile you know look i'm gonna say something can i say something is it gonna be illegal this game, this is funny. I don't think this is a video game, though. You don't think this is a video game? I think this falls into my personal category of not enough game to justify being a video game. But we I'm have sorry. barely even played it yet. I, I I know. All we've done is just talk to people. I know. I'm saying this in any other game, we'd still be in cutscenes. Are those not video games? Depends on how many cutscenes. Depends on how many cutscenes. Guns of the Patriots that... is not <laughs> is not a video. Game. <laughs> Do you think? I think it's like visual novels, right? It's like if you if you're playing a visual novel and it has a lot of choice in it, I could see that being a video game. But if it's a visual novel and it has barely any choice in it, it's not a video game. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I just complimented this man's teeth. It's like that John Cage song. What is it? Three minutes, 42 seconds. Three minutes and 33 seconds. Is that yeah. what it is? Yeah. It's just silence. It's like, I get what you're going here. I can consider it art. I don't think it's music. Yeah. Because you're you're not doing the, the core thing that your aesthetic medium does. Requires. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't mean to get into this, but we're detectives. We're uh, Today's mystery is... We're solving art. Yeah, that's a game. How do, how do I get his two face from him? Oops. No, I don't want to talk to you again. I'm going to have to find a way to get it. I'll come back later. For your toothpaste. Hey, I want your you... toothpaste. Who's that guy? Are you excited Ooh, for scared. extra life? What the fuck? It's disgusting. 
Ugh. Oh, here's Sloth Boy. It's probably a cicada. This Martin. guy looks creepy as fuck. <laughs> he's the one who lives on the island, and he said he hears ghosts. Yeah. It was possible for the tire approach. I'm sorry. He's so cranky. Can I ask you a question? Mm hmm. You know what? Give me a second. I'm going to look up the answer to this, and then I'm going to ask you the question. Okay. Okay. Sorry, I just need to look this up real quick. Dance Do competition. You okay, here's the question. Are you ready? Go for it. Do you think there is rule 34 of Frog Detective? A thousand percent yes. The answer is no. I, going off of rule 34, which I think is definitive. You search frog underscore detective. Oh, you know what? I didn't do frog underscore detective. I just did frog space detective. That's a good question. <sighs> Nothing. Really? That's surprising. That's right? very surprising. Because right, frog detective is popular. The dance competition tomorrow. <laughs> Who's Finley? Anyways, I've been prepping for Extra Life. I've been checking my hardware. Uh, I bought 96 AA batteries. Holy shit. Because I did some calculations and I was like, all the controllers plus the four lav mics for 24 hours. And then I put some extra on top and I was like, 96 is a good number. Yeah, that's a pretty good number. Yeah, I was so, trying to think of... Um, I was thinking of ordering stuff off of AliExpress and Amazon and just sending it to your house. <laughs> You so could, I, I could just store it. Um, it's uh, totally if you want to. I was looking at AliExpress last night. I do like the idea. It's unofficial, but we've been talking about it enough where everybody is bringing joke t-shirts. Well, I, would, I shouldn't say yeah. everybody. I know Jake's been Jake has some at least one t-shirt he's mentioned. I know you were talking about it. I was looking last night and I was like, it's a funny bit. Yeah, we we had a we had a long conversation about it, and then Jake had mentioned it the next day in Discord, and I was like, "Oh, that's funny." And then Karen saw a Instagram reel, and she was like, "This is what we're gonna do." And I was like, "Oh, okay." Yeah, <laughs> I I'm buying multiple shirts. I like the idea of we've got multiple rounds of funny shirts that we just show up on camera with. Yeah, I was thinking of getting some like random, like, uh, like. Yeah, like weird shirts, weird onesies, weird stuff like that. Yeah. So the thing is, I do have we haven't we haven't finalized our unlocks for the audience. We haven't finalized our donation unlocks, but I've been filling that list out because my take is for this year, we should have an unlock every like fifty dollars. We should mm. just always have an unlock close. And I I have multiple costumes already in the closet that we could do so. Yeah, we're on the same page. I'm excited. Though. I think. Be yeah, fun. I'm excited too. I gotta come up with some more ideas. I put this a whole guy bunch said of food someone stuff. else lived on the island with him, and he hasn't seen them in a while. And he's like, "Oh, they're probably preparing for the uh, dance competition tomorrow." So I think oh. maybe the per other person who lives on the island fell in the cave, and they're trying to yell to get out. And, uh, well, let's just go to the cave. Let's see what happens. I know. I got to get all this stuff. Visual Exorcism. Exorcism. Oh, visualization. Man, I, I got slightly, very, very slightly insulted, but I feel like I should tell you the scenario and see if you would be slightly insulted as well. I mean, I'm insulted just hearing about it. So, um, I went to a dinner party with Maggie and her new co-workers oh, no. and some of the couples were older in their like 40s and 50s right oh, no. and um, at one point the exorcist come, came up the movie and one of them turned to us and was like well one, one of them said oh they probably we have young people here they probably don't even know that movie and I was like it's like I know that movie and then, the, and then the guy was like, well, wait, there's been recent ones 
which one do you know? And I was like, the William Friedkin one. <laughs> and he was like, okay, okay. And I got just a little bit offended where I was like, I was like, well, I guess I look younger than I am. I mean, I'm 33. I'm not that young anymore. But also, like, I'm not a fucking millennial idiot that's just... Okay, I am on TikTok all day, but I'm not like <laughs> oblivious to culture, you know. <laughs> is that is that I didn't I didn't like start a scene or anything, but it was one of those things where it He's irked dead. me just a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Um yeah, I feel like uh would you get irked uh, in that in that situation? Uh, only we yeah, only we, well, I haven't seen the exorcist, but I have heard of it, so I'm not an <laughs> idiot. Um It's fair. And I, honestly, I didn't even know there was a remake of it, so I was the exact opposite of that. But also, there's a certain there's age. Been two or three. There's a certain age where you can like, e like I would say like 21 and below, you can easily be like, oh, I they're too young to know about that, blah blah blah. But there's a certain age where you reach where like, you can yeah. watch any movie, and like, it's people who don't just watch recent movies all the time. Like there are people who do that. But yeah, I, I, I think I agree with you. I would just say I think 21 is too high. I would say like 14 or 15, not not to have seen it, but to at least know what I'm talking about in, instead of like, the, yeah, that's the true. To know one. what you're talking about. But I was yeah. going to say, like, I, I think I think 21 and under, it's OK to say that too. like, oh, I don't think they've heard of it. They're a little yeah. young. Yeah. Like, I would yeah. call a person under 21 young. <laughs> yeah. And, like, so anyways, I shot him. <laughs> I'm a fucking cinephile. How dare you? How dare you? You haven't been to my letterbox. I saw you. I saw that guy. Did you see him? Why do you think I'm paying attention to this game? You talking about that guy by the tree? Oh, watch out here. Oh, yeah. Go over there. Can't. It's as far as I can go. Just keep going. I have room now, though. Which uh, which key are you pressing? Are you pressing the one that looks like two U's next to each other, <laughs> like two V's attached? There we go. <laughs> two U's. I'm not pressing the boom oh, button. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry that I described a W as two U's. <laughs> yeah, it's your fault, not mine. <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> Oh, fucking die it all Mo. Hey. You know it's what really I'm genuinely for me excited to for? A... Oh, God. Yeah, this is more important than your your stupid game. Um, That we recently decided that while you guys are down here, we're going to watch the Super Mario Brothers movie. Mm -hmm. I'm so excited. I'm excited. Yeah. I've been wanting to rewatch that movie for years. I've never seen it. We could do it. We could do a double feature. We could do that and Shin Godzilla. <laughs> Can I ask you a genuine question, though? I I I know it was my mistake to force that on you in that moment, but I'm just I was just so excited to watch it and share it. Have you watched it again recently on your own time? I have not. Have you thought about it? Yeah. Okay, that's fair. I just want to make I, sure I, I didn't gonna... ruin that movie for you. <laughs> I don't know if you understand this again. I love that movie. I'll just never publicly admit to it. <laughs> <laughs> but there was it's way part easier of me to say like... it's a bad movie. <laughs> it's the same thing movie, with the, the Green Knight and my friend at work. I like, mm -hmm. like, I didn't like the Green Knight that much, but it wasn't. A, I just, I was like, oh, that piece of shit, that trash. <laughs> like, oh, <laughs> and now you're committed to the bit. Now yeah. you're committed to it. I love uh, it. I, I, we're on the same way. Wait, um, because like a, a slight tangent. Do you have? Do you have? <sighs> Sorry, I'm trying to figure out how to put this. I cry every time I see Shin Godzilla. <laughs> and I'm not sure why. But do you have uh, like certain themes or movies or things that always make you choke up and start tearing up inexplicably? Like choking up, tearing up? 
Yeah, like um, I this is I've said this several times, but I will say it again. I I choked up when Momar Gaddafi died. <laughs> Cause it was just like watching that on fucking pirated Libyan television. And I was like, <laughs> damn, what a moment. I mean when our when our boys were repelled at the Capitol. <laughs> <laughs> Um, when I heard about Ashley Babbitt, <laughs> innocent protester, just trying to climb through a door. Oh, that's, that's maybe getting too far. Uh, we gave up on Frog Detective. Is it because of me or is it because of not the right game for the moment? Or is it because of the game itself? Give me your honest take. Wow, he's just left the fucking stream. It was 100 percent you. <laughs> that's fair. That's fair. But we're having more fun um, here. Is, what is this, Baba? Is you? Um, uh, sorry, I just gotta capture it so people. I don't know why it isn't okay. full screen. It's because it's a window, and it's low res. <laughs> okay, so I I haven't played Baba. Are we sharing it yet? I'm about share? to share it. Can you? I'm just hold on. Second. I'm trying to pay attention to the game. You just criticized me for not paying to. You're not even paying attention to the game. <laughs> I hate you. Okay, this is uh, this is Mola. <laughs> this is Baba Mo is you. Mo Mola okay. Nisa, I think is what it was called. Oh, is it? Is it a oh, Baba? Is, that is a good oh, name okay. for a Baba is you knockoff. So, um, essentially, uh, you always have the same uh, weapons. I think is what it is. Move. Uh, how do I shoot? Yeah. Uh, left. Oh. That's cool. Okay, so now we go to the next. This game is random. Sometimes you can win and sometimes you cannot. And when you shoot, what what was it? It was doing blocks and then it was doing like a mushroom. Yeah, so right now, right now I have nothing. Advice, never give up. Bamboo must not be aimed at the floor. Why don't you jump on the... What? What? What do I want? When you sh oh, is that stuff at the bottom what you can shoot? Oh, I fell off. You f fucking idiot. Now this is a video game. So you have to get to the... You have to get to the to the vortex. I guess so. Okay, I have a bomb, and I have a fish, and I have an insta box. Do you think I can walk Where on you... this? Oh. oh yeah. So you got to get to the to the apple. Oh, oh I should have done that differently. What are you? Why don't you just shoot more stuff? Oh, you've... Because I only get, like, one of each. Are you sure? That turned me into a butterfly! <laughs> what? What? Mosalina, that's what it is. It's not Mussolina. an immersive sim, in case you were wondering. That's my favorite Italian dictator. Mosalina? Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> You have her on the shirt, don't you? <laughs> Give me a second. You know what I was looking up last night? Actually, you know what? I'm not going to tell you because I'm not sure if it's actually going to happen or not. I wasn't finding what I wanted. And I, OK, here's my biggest fear. I don't want to have to do a custom shirt through AliExpress because what I've been told is that it's very difficult to communicate to sellers because their English is usually terrible. So they send you messages to like confirm the design and stuff and you just can't really understand and they don't understand you so it just becomes a a mess the game is so weird uh oh hey there we go yeah what if i got a mussolini shirt <laughs> <laughs> I got a Mussolini shirt. 
Yeah. Ooh, I love that's this That's just one. what the doctor ordered. Well, okay, now why did you think you only get one of each? Because you do. I don't have any more bamboo. But where do you where do you see that? Like your ammo see count or whatever. Out now. See that item count above my oh, head? Oh, in the top left. Oh, now okay. I now I got you. Now I have one. And the X. Okay. Got it. Oh, you could have shot the bomb and fruit yourself. Yeah. Yeah, I saw this on Twitter. It was four bucks. So I was like, oh, this looks like fun. It was basically just like everything's random. It's pretty cool. All right. You got bomb. See, why did my bamboo? head become bamboo? Because I think that's what you're going to shoot. Ooh, good. That's what I was thinking, too. Okay, go get that. Jump on it. Jump on it. Jump on it. Oh, now you got to jump on that. Oh, oh you oh. fucked up. You fucking I idiot. I should have sent the... I think I can send the butterfly. I should have sent the butterfly. That's, what, that's a character I've been working on called the supportive asshole, where you're supportive, like very supportive, right up till the moment of failure, and then you just turn. You fucking idiot. Why'd you fucking do that? You could do it. Oh, Come on. oh here, here. You got watch it. this one. Oh, I believe no. you. Oh, there's the butterfly. Oh, no. Okay. I put the butterfly. Yeah, so use the butterfly. Okay, now get the fruit. Get the. <laughs> you fucking. You, fuck you. <laughs> you didn't think it would work. Of course it wouldn't work. Okay, all right. Let's think this through. Use your head. <laughs> oh. Can you put a bomb past it? Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I hate this game, but it's pretty good so far. Okay, this one I did last time. Can okay, you so do... The... Hit the wrong button. Yeah, I was about to say. But you have an X, and then you have... What's the box? Oh, it's just boxes. Whoa! Antigraph? Oh. Oh, it's like a bouncy. Snow gravity. Still figuring it out. <laughs> okay, so the X the X is a, a box, is a little platform. You got a bomb and you got a ladder. Uh, can you try and shoot the bomb? I would put the ladder. I would go all the way to the right, put the ladder, get the fruit, and then put a and then try and shoot a bomb above the. Oh, that's not how fucking oh, ladders work. Oh, I had to be looking down, I think. Or maybe it's like bamboo. You're supposed to, like, do it at an angle. Yeah, and then I was thinking you could shoot the bomb at the fruit to push it towards the platform. Yeah. Oh, but then you couldn't get back up. Fish fear. I do like its commi commitment to randomness. Yeah. Me gusta. Okay. So if I, if I put a butterfly up here. What's the butterfly do? No, why does it go over there? Oh. What, what does the butterfly do? It uh teleports me. Like, I teleport back to it. Oh. Uh, can you shoot the butterfly straight up? Or no? I think you just gotta jump into the spinny boy. Oh, it sends me to where I'm pointing and puts a butterfly where I wasn't. You try. Oh, that's your pool of random items. Oh, I see. Okay, so I'll do ladder. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh. Mobilize. What do you think that does? I don't know. Just gotta try it out. Oh, 
Oh, it lifts it. Fuck yeah. So yeah, if the fruit nice. loses the screen, I guess is the same as collecting it. Either touch it or leave the screen. Okay, I'm going to... Can you shoot the... Shoot the... Oh, but you gotta get back. I would just shoot the rocket. Can you shoot the rocket of the portal? A good test. <gasps> yeah! Fuck! Yo, you smart! What's the little apple do? Might be an apple. Pomegranate. Oh. What do you Instabox think in the middle. Does? What if you yeah. jumped Instabox? Oh, your jump's not long. Oh! Oh! Jesus I fucked Christ! It. I fucked it. I thoroughly fucked it. Okay, James Joyce. Okay. I meant to. Uh, I wanted to change what game we were playing on. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Why do people drink whiskey? Because it's good sometimes it's not for the taste let's be honest it's not for the taste pomegranates are dangerous oh oh did it suck it no it felt like it it brought it in right instead of pushing it away oh, oh why did i have to fall off oh and at the top is that telling you Back here. Oh. Okay, let's fall and do an insta box. Yeah, you can do an insta box, jump it, insta box mushroom. And then mushroom to bounce back up. I don't know if the mushroom's gonna make you go far oh, enough, oh. but. Panicked. Panic at the disco. <gasps> frog detective. We should play frog detective. That's a detective game. <laughs> I just them. immediately died. You you got it, and you got boxes too. I don't need boxes. Box this dick. Fuck oh, yeah. Box this dick. Ah, a mystery. See? Oh, you fucking idiot. Do the do the frog at it. What does the frog do? <gasps> I think that counts, right? <gasps> oh, you. Oh, geez. Those circles are slippery. It's like they ain't got no flat ground for you to stand on. What the heck happening? I like that. I like and now I have I'm like completing the other ones. Uh -huh. You're doing great. Everybody's talking about you. Oh, and then jump on the box and do a mushroom. Oof. I think you got a mushroom. Oh, yeah. yeah. Very smart, Ian. Touched farts. <laughs> I did think it's a touch fart. So, so the top, I think the top is like the levels, right? So you yeah. have nine levels you have to get through. <gasps> yes! oh! That's incredible. This might be a good, uh, this would be a good extra life game with like punishments. Or like you, if you don't, if you make it past the level, you don't like. I don't know, whatever. Get taste. What's this game called? Moaning Lisa. Uh, uh I just every time you can laugh at it. I made a joke. It's okay to laugh. You don't have to hold it in. <laughs> I heard that you were like. Oh, oh. Also, I just noticed oh. Kyle's tags for when he streams. 
including <laughs> gay bear. <laughs> I and know. I, just want people I feel to tune in and wonder which one of us to get there. It's both. I'm a Harry uh, it's Twink. Mo- <laughs> Mosalina. Um, I'll put that in. I'll just put it in the backup games, honestly. Yeah, it's pretty good. Okay. This Ooh. is on basically Ooh. Steam Deck. I'll call it. Does this okay, play I'm on gonna... Steam Deck? Uh, it must. Oh no. I'm gonna take the rocket. Wait, what? I thought we control the rocket last time. Huh. Ooh, it may only play on Windows. No, I think I bought it. It said stack, stack, deck compatible. Okay. I'm not saying you're wrong, I just, you know. You're not saying I'm right either. Yeah, fuck that guy. Can't you run left? Up the branch. Oh, oh nice try. <clears throat> Usher? Oh, Beautiful. Sorry. Touch farts. I love you. Touch farts. <laughs> <laughs> this game is truly random. Um, what do you think? Rocket. What's the pomegranate do? It sucks things in, right? It's like the opposite of the bomb. Ooh. Oh, you have, but you have another mobilize. Oh. Where's it going? No! Oh, but you got the pomegranate. Shoot the pomegranate at it. Okay. Fucking idiot. You. <laughs> you idiot. You idiot. Imagine like a psychiatrist being like, what do you see here? Uh, my parents fighting? You You idiot. fucking idiot. What does the frog do? Did we figure out what the frog does? Can we just shoot it? Oh, it's, it drops it down below. If it touches the, the fruit, it'll drop it down below. So can you jump all the way? Oh yeah. And then rock it. Hell yeah, Beautiful. baby. Beautiful. Good job. Beautiful. Okay, which one's this one? This one. Okay, I've got Instacrates. Do you think I can lob a I think, bomb all the way over there? I think two Instacrates on the way over there. So you, you build two Instacrates, one, leapfrog it, two, and then well, maybe box up this guy or uh, some of your boxes just to get over there because then I mean, you can, can just... you can get back. Oh, okay. Yes. There you go. There you go. Yeah. And then get back on the X's and then Instacrate. I mean, box it up. Fuck yes. Yeah. One left. Can we do it? Oh my goodness, it gets so intense. What? What oh did you do to God. me? Turned it into a nightmare. Um. Oh, there's stuff over here. Free stuff? I hope so. Oh, I can trade oh, things. Oh, can you can you waste it and then trade it? Ooh, that'd be nice. Uh, oh, well, I was thinking, what if I... This hits a bomb up? To take care of those? Yeah, that could help. Ah. Uh, Oof. I think the ones at the top left are going to be hard. Those are going to be super hard. I mean, I guess I box it, right? Oof, you're at an angle, though. But you can't touch them spikes. Maybe try and mushroom it. Oh no, I think you're just. Ooh, you could have boxed on the spikes. You fucking idiot. <gasps> Damn. Are we gonna do the same final level? Yeah. 
Um, I know you can't shoot the oh, but we got to somehow shoot all the way to the left. That top left, I think, is going to be your hardest. Yeah. Do you have? Can you go to the right and see again? what you got? I think pomegranate sucks it in. I think it's an opposite bomb, or it just goes down. So I could use this to go up. I think you really need a rocket. I wish I had a rocket. You could use the boxes to try and get on the spikes, but you're still not going to. You could use that on the spikes to get close enough to then shoot something out oh. the top left. Fuck me. Can't believe I just did that. Okay. Well, we have this anti gravity thing now. It doesn't shoot far enough, right? Can you try? Can we just try boxing up and then anti gravity to the left to see, see how it feels? Maybe jump shoot. Oh! I forgot it works on everything. Is that useful though? Could we use it to get rid of the spikes? That sucks. <laughs> oh, there we go. <gasps> oh, it took it. It took it. Bounce and then and then bomb up the two up there. Oh. Bomb, bomb. I don't have any bombs left, oh. I don't think. Oh, I, you do have one, but I think you're smarter now. Oh, yeah, I did that one. Yeah, yeah. So now we just need to figure out how to get all the way over there, but you have stuff. We just try and jump up and, and shoot a frog. Yeah, that's not the worst. Uh, doesn't the frog hop? But the frog dies to spikes. Oh, don't fuck me. Um. Huh. I really wish How many I frogs you got? Um, two frogs. Frogs died to spikes, though. But that doesn't really help. So the mobile, I, I think the number one problem is you can't, you can't really shoot that far. But if you try and box all the way up and then jump and shoot the mobile eyes at it, that may but be I'll far enough die. to hit it. No, you won't. You'll be on top of the boxes. I'm saying jump straight up. Oh. Yeah. This is then jump and shoot left. Oh. Uh, but it might take it up with it. Oh. Go, you fuck. It might slowly be moving. I don't know. Not anymore. But you've got. Oh, you still have one left. Can you shoot it? Shoot it at a, at a, at an uh an up left angle. Yeah, but it'll it'll just do that. Oh, but that could take that stuff and bounce it. <sighs> But you got stuff on the right. You've got the... Yeah, but you're not going to be able to get back up there. This is tough. This is yeah. truly a puzzle. It is truly a mystery. See if it will try again. I think you're right. I think you're right, though. I think if we get the mobilize and just shoot it in the middle of the spikes, it may take both of them out on the way up. You're right, this this is a good extra life game because everybody's like cheering for you. <clears throat> I like having those bouncies up front. So you, do you kind of see what I'm saying though? If you if you shoot a mobilize in the middle of the spikes, 
it may lift all of them up. Yeah, I think you're right. So I think it's maybe mushroom on the left platform plus mobilize shoot at an up left angle so it hits the middle of the spikes. Well, you don't I, have a mobilize, I could, though. If I, I get, get it. Do we have, oh, we don't have boxes. That kind of sucks. Yeah. So I was thinking you put down a mushroom on the on the far left. Yeah, there. And then you aim up left. Ooh, that's good. Oh, got stuck on the fucking fruit. Oh, but you have another one. Do it. Oh. Do it. Oh, yeah. So we need a little bit more height to hit the top, the top spikes. Mobilize plus bounce. Oh, it pushed it. Yeah, these two you've got down pat. What if you just jump, use this to jump left at the at its height? Shoot a mobilizer. Yeah, even though it's it's a little bit squirrely, like it drops quickly, but it could be worth a try. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Wow. Yeah, let's try. So you're at the top. You let it go, take you all the way up, and then you jump to the left and shoot a mobilize. Left. Ah, it's about the same. I think you're right. We just need more height on the left side. <gasps> oh. oh, no. Is it going to kick me out entirely? Oh. oh. No, you're still good. Okay, so we got these boys again. So should we just... Can we go to the right to see if you have a mushroom? No, he's doing that. Oh, no mushroom. No mushroom. Okay, maybe we just box all the way up left and then try and shoot the mobilize at the top. Oh, no, it's got to go farther left. Oh, shit. Left. Yeah, it's got to hit. It's got to hit the, the top spikes. This is tough. Yeah, I'm like, I wonder if. We're close. We just need to figure out the combination of height and just enough to throw it on the left hand side. Yeah. The other thing is some of the stuff like the bombs and stuff do they throw further because i think what's killing us with the mobilize is that it immediately drops if there's something that's a little bit more of a distance or straight trajectory i mean this goes the... yeah but you know you know what i'm saying right yeah the bomb goes where the arrow is like this thing goes where the arrow is but does it so, so does it drop as quickly or the mobilizer does it go further so, listen, I could go here and then build the books is up. There. Oh, I see what you're saying. So let me try that. Because I got boxes here. But I got I got no bouncy boys here. I'd rather get a better draw. Still no bounces. There we go. That's perfect. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So, so I'm going to just trade the, the bounces for now. Yeah, to exit, to get you over to the spikes and then build boxes on the spikes. OK. And so I'll put this here. Oh, my God. It, 
I got like, you. Oh, it sends you right over. Uh, okay. I don't want that. Oh, I realize it's. Yeah. I think it's taking points away when I die. This should be okay. Hey, how's Napoleon? Is he doing okay? Yeah, he's great. He's hanging out in Egypt now. Oh, stealing shit from the pyramids, stealing yeah, the, the capstone. He, yeah, he stole the uh, stuff from Venice already. You know what? Genuinely, I'm okay with Napoleon. The one thing I cannot tolerate is desecrating the pyramid. That's inappropriate. Ooh, nice, and then you could build boxes on that. Oh, shoot that mobilize, shoot it top left on an arc. Yes! yes! Okay, now we just have to go get the other two with the bouncy. Don't use it. Okay. Yes! What if this isn't the end? What if it's not the end? Oh! <gasps> My god, it's gorgeous. Go, go down, see what's down. I don't think anything's down. Could just be credits or it just restarts. Oh. What? That was pretty what good. Was that? This is a good game. I was that was good. That was really cool. That was a this great is, mystery. Uh, I can't believe we solved it. Mosa Lena. Uh, it's like three bucks, four bucks on Steam. I uh, highly recommend checking it out. It was uh, it's pretty crazy. Um, yeah. I think that's going to be it for Case Crackers. And that's going to be it for this stream here today. Folks, if you enjoyed this, you can head on over to subpixelfilms.com. They'll bring you straight to our link tree. Where you can buy, where you can find all sorts of good stuff like our Twitch, our YouTube, uh, our Twitters, <laughs> and then of course our Red Bull merch site, where we make millions of dollars every week. Uh, we'll be back uh, Thursday with Kyle and Jimmy for some local chat, talking about all sorts of video games we've been playing and the news. Um. And then uh, we'll be back uh, on the weekend. I think Kyle's going to be playing some Spooky Pixel. Uh, so uh, get excited for that. Uh, Ian, anything you want to uh -huh. plug? Uh, you're, um, you're headed to jail for a week. How's that going? Uh, you know, I, I will never regret that day in January. I did what <laughs> I needed to do for my country. Sentencing be damned. Sentencing <laughs> be damned. They asked me to show up down there, and I ain't going to. Folks, thank you so much for watching. We love all each and every one of you, and we'll see you all on Thursday. Bye.